All right, guys, we're back again. As you can see here, my helper forgot to turn the vacuum on. He started cutting the concrete to replace this sump pump pit. Smoke, dust all over the place. He's using the new mask for COVID and dust. It's called put your shirt over their nose. That'll protect you. Uh, so we're cutting out the concrete here. We're going to chip it out. He's going to probably get the chipper in a few. He's going to start chipping out. Uh, we got to remove this uh, sump pump pit, which is a uh, real thin metal. It's all corroded. Uh, customers complaining about a lot of dirt getting inside there. Obviously, there's a big ass hole in your pit. So what we'll do is we'll, we'll cut out the concrete all around, start digging, take that pit out. Uh, we're going to reuse the pump and the check valve since it's probably three months old. Uh, but we'll cut out all that PVC. And in a few, you'll see when he starts digging up all that concrete and dirt. Uh, we're going to expose a two inch cast iron underground. We'll cut that out. We'll replace it a uh, PVC and uh, we'll drain the sump pump into the drain. Yep, I know everybody's going to say you can't drain the sump pump into the sewer. But guess what? In this house, we could. Why? Because it's an El Chapo cell. The toilet's right there and we're digging a tunnel under the house. So stop bitching and complaining and just check out the video. Here we go. He's taking out the rock, all the dirt. It's a real small space. Uh, he barely could get two guys in there. So we, I just left him there to do his magic. Uh, he's thinking. He's going to pull out the check valve, the pump. He's going to take everything out again. At least there's no more dust in the air because we put a fan on and we extracted everything. I think that's the unfinished basement. We don't worry about uh, messing up the, the finished basement if it was finished. But here we go. He's sweeping up a little. Not sure why if he's going to dig any more. Uh, you see, you saw the little pit right there. That's all it was. It was probably a 15 inch round by 12 inches deep. Garbage. Pump barely fit in there. So he's gonna, we're going to take out a... Uh, he just exposed a two inch cast iron, as you can see there. We'll cut all that out, put that at PVC. He's gonna dig a nice tunnel for El Chapo to escape from his cell. Uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna place a, a regular sump pump pit basin in there. Uh, we're gonna drill a couple holes in it, put stone all around it, and then uh, we'll re-concrete it back up. We took out probably eight to nine five gallon buckets out of there of dirt uh, and we filled it all back up with a uh, stone drain stone uh, you're gonna see here he's taking out more dirt digging that tunnel pretty deep even though the chop was real small we got to try to get him in there trying to escape and here we go he disappears boom boom he's sweeping again OCD you know kicks in got to sweep everything here we go, here we go, and boom, he knocks my camera down, and the camera broke, and I just had to film a little of the finished product. There it goes. All right, if you live in North Jersey, need some plumbing work done or heating, let us know. Mention YouTube, and we'll give you a discount. Check you out on the next one.